Before describing the phase modulation, it is important to understand the concept of phase. What is phase? So, let's understand it. What is phase? Before this, phase is the position of a point at some time instant. What is phase? Phase is the position of a point okay, at some time instant. So, phase difference. Let's understand the phase difference. What is phase difference then? The phase difference is uh, created when a wave moves horizontally on the time axis. When some wave form, let's understand it with the help of, again, with the help of uh, a diagram. Here I will draw two wave forms, two sinusoidal wave forms, having some phase difference this is the first wave okay and this one is the second you know this uh, point oops, this is zero if this is uh, a sinusoidal wave this is zero pi two pi radians this one is the first wave and this is the pi by two so This is another sinusoidal wave. This is the first wave. Let's call it first. This one the second. And you should know that this one is the leading wave form. This one. Leading in phase by 90 degrees or pi by 2. Okay. As you can see, this wave has been moved horizontally. Since if you draw this, the form will be like this. I'm just making it with the help of dots. So this waveform, this shown in blue second waveform, is pi by two ahead of this first waveform shown in green. So this is the leading, and this is the lagging. This blue one is the leading wave and the green one is the lagging wave. Uh, these waves are called to be in phase quadrature because these are 90 degree uh, at 90 degree phase difference so these are in phase uh, quadrature but if they differ by a phase difference of 180 degrees like pi then uh, these are called in phase opposition. So now let's uh, define the phase modulation. Let's come to our topic phase modulation what is phase modulation the phase mo in phase modulation the instantaneous phase of the carrier wave is varied according to the amplitude of the message signal okay here we will vary the phase of the carrier wave as we have seen in amplitude and frequency we varied the amplitude and frequency of the carrier so in phase we will just vary the phase of the carrier wave. So let's analyze the waveform of the phase modulation, phase uh, modulated wave. This is the time axis. I'm drawing the message signal. Okay, this is the message. Message signal and this one I'm drawing here the carrier wave and this is the carrier wave having a constant amplitude and a constant high frequency so now I'm drawing the phase modulated wave only the phase of the carrier will be varied here not the frequency neither the amplitude only the phase the information will be contained in the phase changes this is a phase modulated wave I'm going to draw so let's observe it these are the times when the message signal cuts the time axis 
I will show you its importance why I am drawing these lines at this instance the message signal cuts the axis this 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 point this point and this point okay I have drawn vertical lines through this so understand it how does this happen at these instants only at these instants the phase will change at these three instants in this diagram so how does this happen okay this the original path was like this but it goes in this direction again at this point the original path was in this direction but a phase change happens here and it goes the same thing happens at this point okay I think it's clear so these are the three points where the phase change has occurred okay these are the three points phase change has occurred okay so for the phase change means just the horizontal shifting of this wave we have uh, shifted this wave this the original path was in this direction it shape would have been like this but we have shifted this wave in the horizontal direction so this was the phase modulated wave form Friends, for more such videos, you can uh, subscribe my channel, Engineering Made Easy. And please don't forget to like and share the video if you liked it. For more detailed information, you can uh, visit my blog, www.engineeringmadeeasypro.com. Its link is given in the description of this video. You can check it. And uh, see you soon in the next video. Till then, bye-bye.